Click on the shortcut you just made to open up the Excel file. And if it's the first time you're opening this or you haven't made the Y drive a trusted location yet, uh, it's going to give you some errors in the top or uh, some warnings. It's up here in the top. It'll open a protective view. It says that because files on the internet can contain viruses, and unless you need to edit, it's safer to stay in protected view. Well, that's because I have uh, this is a macro enabled workbook. Uh, there's some code behind Excel to have it do some certain things, and uh, so uh, it may uh, interpret it as possible malware. So we want to go ahead and just trust it, say enable editing. Then we'll bring up a security warning as well. We want to enable the content, and again, that has to do with the macros. Then this flash screen will come up, or really it's, it's a menu, um, and to pick the uh, shift that, that you're on. So we'll click B shift. Now we don't have to do this every time, so we're going to go ahead and make the Y drive a trusted location. That means Excel will understand and that uh, any files we open up there are safe. So um, we want to go to File. Now if you're using Excel 2007 um, or 2010, it will have the circle up there. All the options are the same. Just make sure you go to File and you'll find the options. They're all on the bottom. So click Options. No matter what version you're using, it'll have this this uh, dialog box come up. I want to go to Trust Center. Then the very bottom of the left-hand menu. Then on the far right, Trust Center Settings. And again on the left side, the second one is Trusted Locations. Okay. Down here, you want to make sure that these two check boxes here allow trusted locations on my network is checked, and the Disable All Trusted Locations is not checked. And we'll click on add new location. So we need to browse here and we'll look for the Y drive again. And we can see it right under here on the left side menu. Uh, this uh, all city directory and an ending in Y. Uh, as you see here, the Y drive is selected. We went OK. And yes, you could have just typed Y colon backslash, but uh, it's OK. Important here is to uh, make sure you check subfolders this location are also trusted. That means all folders within the Y drive are safe to use. Now all you do is hit OK. Hit OK again and one more time. All right, now to see if this works, we're going to close this out. Save, just for the sake of saving. Then we're going to open it up. And it should come right up. Uh, it'll ask about updating links. Uh, it'll do that every time. Go ahead and click update. New splash screen comes up. Um, so that means that the Y drive is trusted and allow us to run macros right off the bat. 